Hey folks, welcome to another episode of Orphan for All. In this video, we are going to geolocate Mr. Elliot Alderson from Mr. Robot. Let's start from the beginning. What if we didn't know anything about this image? How could we approach this target? If you have guessed it, you are right. Reverse image search. By the way, I have made a series of videos on reverse image search and you can watch that playlist and I'm also going to provide you the link in the description. You don't have to search for it. Coming back, if we do reverse image search, we'll find out that this image was taken from a TV show called Mr. Robot and this person's name is Elliot Alderson in that TV show. Great, we have found the primary source that is this screenshot or this image was taken from a TV show. That's good. And the second thing is where this TV show was shot. If you just go through some of the articles or if you just uh, Google a bit, you'll get to know that this particular episode or this particular season was shot in New York. Then we have like two main information. That is one, this is from a TV show. It means it is like entirely fiction and we are just geolocating it for fun. And the second thing is, yeah, it's in New York. So now the real hunt begins. Now we have to pinpoint where Elliot was standing in this frame. Yeah, and we can do that. So let's start. As any great geolocator would do, first what you have to do, you just have to see the backdrop. This is like alpha or sigma rule. I have just uh, mocked about it in my post anyway. Uh, so yeah, what we can see here, that is like Irish pub, bar and restaurant. And uh, let's go here in the maps. I'm using Google Maps. And uh, we'll just put like Irish pub. USA Irish pub bar and okay it's not showing anything let's put irish pub pub and bar or maybe let's see what are the results that we are going to get yeah we have like plenty of results here and uh, i don't see any irish pub probably different franchises or something like that okay let's try to click on yeah and it says like twins irish pub okay this is uh, twins irish pub where is it so let me zoom in here let me click on twins irish pub oh is this the restaurant that we are looking i don't think so and we don't have a clear view um let's try to go here Maybe we'll copy this and we'll just put the address here. Okay, great. Yes, this is the place. And uh, let's try to see that in a satellite view. Okay, this looks um, okay, okay. And uh, yeah, here I can enable the street view and if i go here okay this is some place hmm. okay we don't see any irish pub here or even if we see uh, this is not the one that we are looking for because the buildings around are not as same in the picture right so yeah, this is not the place that we are looking for. Whoa. So now, like any other sad O center, oh, I cannot find Irish pub or I have to go through like a lot of things here. Let's go back and let's see. Yes, and we have all these other Irish pubs or something. Twins Irish pub was not the one that we are looking. 
yeah and even if you go through all these things you are not going to go anywhere and uh, yeah then is it a roadblock so what are the other things that you can see okay let's not give up let's try to find this that is uh, if we zoom it or if you have this image uh, you can get to know that uh, pig whistle it says something like pig and whistle okay even though it is uh, blurry and you can use uh, remini.com something like that app.remini.com which kind of tries to um, make a blur image clearer and i have covered this in my reverse image search videos you can go and uh, check that out but we are not going to do that here because i already know yeah so, yeah let's add new york and uh, it says um, pig and okay here we have yes we are near to the target oh my whatever so yeah is this the location let's go and see oh this is a cakewalk it's pretty simple why are you making these videos give me something difficult this is a cakewalk yeah let's see if uh, this is a correct image or something okay now we'll go to the street view and we will see oh it looks something similar here we have like lot of cars how to get rid of this cars we just have to go to a different timeline click here and uh, this is from may 2009 we don't want that because mr robot was shot in like 2015 we'll try to go to 2014 and uh, or maybe we can go to 2016 but we still have cars let's see if there is like 2015 here i don't think so maybe we can go to 2017 here we have less cars click here and we are in 2017 november and we are at pig and whistle oh this is pig and whistle yes now we have found the location is that so yeah it looks pretty okay and it also says um irish pub restaurant but do you think it looks similar don't you think there is something missing here or i'm not bluffing i can also go to like uh, 2014 and this is the image from 2014 so yeah what's missing here it says like irish pub restaurant and it says like pig and whistle yeah we just got the board right not the board right like the words in a board right but not the board right yeah here it says like bar and restaurant and the irish pub is on top of it and here it looks different it says irish pub and restaurant and uh, pig and whistle is in the bottom so yeah and uh, i cannot claim that oh that is the restaurant and i have found it because yeah that's not the truth right so yeah now uh, tell me or just uh, take some time maybe take you know like five seconds and guess what are the other things that you can do and think like you're you're a non-native right because i'm a non-native and i have located this and if you are a non-native or even if you are a native try to deconstruct yourself from your biases and try to uh, see if you can find out some other way to locate this okay yeah we have tried this we did not go anywhere and we have tried this pig and whistle even though we had a blurry image yeah now it's a complete roadblock yeah we cannot find elliot 
and we cannot see this clearly this board and i don't think if we just uh, take a screenshot of this and try to locate this on google maps or if we try to uh, reverse image search this i don't think we are going to get anywhere maybe you can try it you can take the screenshot of this you can unblur this image to some extent and uh, try to find that out and yeah and tell me the results uh, in the comment sections yeah so now how you can approach this target are we going to find elliot or not hmm. but i have to find elliot because elliot is my friend hello friend so yeah i am a non-native i don't know anything about this i don't know anything about new york all the streets and anything now i'm going to give you a mantra and uh, you can call it sigma rule okay so i always tell for people or the people that i know my friends uh, like you just have to google it and many people say that oh googling yeah you know you have to dock it you have to do some google doc in order to get results that is not true okay because search engines especially search engines like google are built because whenever you add something even though you know uh, there are grammatical errors or even if the sentence is incorrect the search engine always try to you know improvise from your search it means you can type anything on the search engine it will try to find a relevant result okay just try it even though like you know everything about grammar and even though uh, you are an expert in english yeah you just try to add maybe grammatically incorrect sentences or you know uh, just something which doesn't make any sense search engines especially google will try to you know give you the exact result so now what i did was like i have already you know geolocated this place and i have written a blog about it i just wanted to share this video because how you can use your you know like common sense to uh, find out like almost anything what i did was yeah i just uh, went through all this uh, restaurant that uh, we found earlier right uh, we got like series of restaurant and uh, i didn't go anywhere it's not like i went through all of them but obviously you know that was not the place and uh, we have covered this uh, uh, particular board even i did that yeah uh, no luck and this one yeah no luck and the only thing that i had was elliot's face and this thing yeah if this board is relevant or something even if you try to unblur this image i don't think you are going to get like lot of information from this board then i just saw these things you know uh, some buildings okay in the background but i noticed something unique about this building the curvature then i just asked google that so something like curvature yeah buildings in new york okay and yeah we just got some result like any nomi search engine will give us so i just went to images and i just doom scroll these images okay i was just looking looking oh what is this um curved buildings let me click here so now i just thought curved building so this building looks kind of similar to this building yeah i might be wrong but i just thought yeah this curvature was pretty similar to this curvature right so now i just found this that is uh, 885 third avenue the lipstick building i just copied this i went to my google maps again i'm going back i just added this okay lipstick building 
it's pretty nice so this is our lipstick building right hmm again I just did this street view thing let me close all this because my computer is kind of slow now I just jumped into the street view hmm okay we have this curvature building here and as I already told you that Mr. Robot was shot in 2015 the first season I just went here and I tried to see if there is like August 2015 okay pretty cool and yeah so this is the building and uh, I just walked in the street in the stride direction So the other thing what I can notice here is this one. Okay, let me try to write um, this building. So this is in a square form. So I just want to see if there is some square buildings nearby. Obviously it is adjacent to the curved building. I went here and uh, here you can see some square but still you know like uh, it could not be the exact one so i just walked in the street for a long time not a very long time yeah i just walked in this direction so now i can see uh, this image pretty clearly not very clearly because there is this uh, sunshine so i will go to 2016 so here I can see uh, this uh, building kind of clearly. So this is our curvature and if you see this image here you cannot uh, see that this building is very near to Elliot. It is in a distance. Now we have to find the distance. So I walked in a straight direction. So here is our curvature and let me walk straight. So here it is. So now what we can see from this angle is, so this is the curvature building that we can see here, right? And this is the square building that we are looking. So now we have to walk in this direction. Just go here and start walking in this direction so now we can get a kind of clear view in terms of two buildings that is one one is like curvature building and another one is the square building so go straight don't turn anywhere and uh, oh so now here you can get this view right the same view that you can see here and even in the image this was the same so Elliot was in this direction and now we just have to find the shop the exact shop oh what is this is this what we are looking pig and whistle Oh, it looks similar. And let's go forward and see in this direction. And here we are. Congratulations. Right. So here we can see Pig and Whistle and uh, you can see the same thing. Right. Irish pub and bar and restaurant. And here you can see the clear image that is like Pig and Whistle and Irish pub. And you can also see this tree where Elliot was there. This could be the tree and you can figure out by the angle. Please save trees. And our Elliot was somewhere here. He was walking in this path. And uh, yeah, we just located the exact location where Elliot was there. 
so probably somewhere here yeah congratulations yeah that's it that is how you geolocate Elliot Alderson from Mr. Robot and uh, please comment down below if you want to see more and more geolocation challenges I have written a blog about this yeah this was a pretty old article of mine I am also going to uh, link that and um, yeah please do uh, like share and subscribe and also uh, follow me on uh, medium and you can also follow me on other uh, social medias join our discord server and also follow OSINT for all twitter page and uh, it goes by the name all for OSINT it's a kind of palindrome that's it i'm going to uh, see you in the next video until then take care bye bye